the paper I need to be shadows here doing a tutorial on how to make a cool looking intro with cinema 4D. Right, firstly what you want to go and do is going to go into MoGraph and go down to text object. Um, and then you want to go to object down here. You want to change the depth to about 100. Then you want to go change the text, whatever you want. I'm just going to go with tutorial. Uh, sorry if my mic so, but sounds a bit weird. I'm just using the mic from the uh, from the computer. Um, you're going to want to have add color to it. Right, just make sure it's on color. I'm going to go with a nice green color. Make it luminous. Make the luminous color, whatever you want. Just kind of give it a nice and after effect kind of job. Just want to go drag it over. Right, that's it. If you rent it out now, the orange will be green. Don't worry, that will look better now. Right. Right. You want to go to click on it, then press Control C, Control V. Then you're gonna click the duplicate of that object and change the depth to 80. Um, you wanna gonna drag it back a bit, just so it's level kind of. And you then you wanna go to caps. You're gonna go to start cap, and then you wanna go to fill cap, and then you wanna go end fill cap. Right, and you wanna gonna make another color for it. I'm gonna go for a luminance blue. Right, so you go over here, you just look for blue, and just click on luminance. You know. Drag it over to the duplicated object. Right there now, if you rent it out, you'll see it looks pretty nice, doesn't it? Yep. Right, what you want to do is click this cube. You want to hold it down and click plane. Then you want to go make the work 10,000 by 10,000 or 100,000, I think. No, 10,000. Then you want to go on to duplicate it by pressing Control C, Control V. And then you want to go to click the duplicate object by pressing this. And you want to go to drag it up, make it as close as you can to 90 degrees. Then you want to go to yeah, bring the text object out. Make sure you click on this here. And then drag it out. And then click on the second text object. Drag it out. Move whatever you want. And render it out. There. And we're going to make a, the back a nice black color. Um, make sure you have the color. Drag it down there. Uh, reflection. I always make it blurry. Quite nice blurry. Make sure it's on black. I always make it nice and blurry. Make it a like gradient, I think it is. For now. Uh, you want to drag it over, bring it to the back. Drag it over, bring it over to the other plane. Right. This has been EGB Shadows. The more, t more subscribers I get, the more Cinema 4D tutorials I will be uploading. So subscribe for more. And whenever I get 20 subscribers, I will be doing a tutorial on how to do movements with keyframes. Right. EGB Shadows, sign out. Peace.